smells so good. You just see the team's eyes light up to see, you know, that they can come here anytime they want to and play. They don't have things like this in their homes. And this is a safe place for them to play. So I'm so excited. Um, words cannot express, you know, my joy for them to have the center right here in the 4th Council District. Well, my favorite aspect of the whole T-Center is honestly the 3D printers because you could come in and kind of like make your own like statues and stuff. And I'm very creative, so I also made me a light. It's somewhere around here, but um, in the recording studio, a lot of um, the kids in my community, we enjoy singing and like rapping and stuff. So it's also neat to have that because I heard that you can make CDs out of the recording studio, so I know that that will be put to great use. This space will be open seven days a week. We feel it's important to be there when the teens need us. It'll be open in the afternoons and the evenings to be a safe and welcoming space for them. This is the first library in the city to offer a Wi-Fi hotspot lending program. The first. The first. Yeah. We understand that teens in this community need access to the internet at home. Through this program, teens can check out a Wi-Fi hotspot to use outside the library for three months. This is the 3D printer that I was referring to earlier. Um, this is kind of what it's gonna look like and this is the 3D actual printer making what that is. It's a Pikachu chess piece, so. We gave a million dollars to this project for one simple reason. We believe in you in this neighborhood and we believe you're the ones that need to work with the library over time to ensure that this library center always produces what works for you.